I'm Jonathan Gano, Public Works Director for the City of Des Moines. The first part of this week saw more than 11 inches of snow delivered to most of Des Moines, and we're looking at yet more snow coming up Thursday night into Friday morning. Maybe another 8 to 10, maybe even 11 inches of snow. One big difference for this next round of snow is that it will be followed by very cold temperatures. When the temperature gets that low, the salt stops working and, and becomes much less effective, uh, taking much longer to melt, if at all. So we will see much slicker roadway conditions. We do have two different layers of parking restrictions. One is in place while we're plowing the snow routes, and the other is in place while we're plowing the neighborhoods. So if it's still snowing, it's a good time to get your car off of a residential street. Once the plows have gone past your house inside a neighborhood, it's now okay to park on that residential street. We try to be done with that within 24 hours, and it takes a really exceptional snowstorm for us to not be able to meet our 24-hour performance mark. We rotate which neighborhoods are last in line so that your street will never always be last. Some streets are always first because of the location of schools in the neighborhood. If it's not yet been 24 hours since the last snowflake fell out of the sky, the chances are that you have not been missed. Your street is just last in the queue this time. Winter driving comes as no surprise to those of us that live here in central Iowa. If you need to get somewhere fast, this is not the time to do that. Plan ahead and take the time to get there so you can arrive safe rather than uh, stuck in the side of the, of the ditch or into the back of a snowplow.